Hey friends, welcome back. So I went to Dollar Tree today. So if you guys are friends with me on Facebook, you saw that I have not been <laughs> Easter basket shopping. I just feel like it just came so fast. So I know that I have eggs like from clearance on Walmart last year, but there's no time for me to go dig them out and figure out where they are. So today I wasted a good $5 buying more eggs. Disregard those erasers. As you can see, that is from a Walgreens and I have not had time to put it up this week. But I'm not doing the usual. I probably haven't done the normal Easter baskets for a few years now. Um, the way my bank account is set up, Ava made the cheer team and Isaac is graduating so my bank account only knows cheer fees, cheer checks, cheer camp, cheer clothes, cheer shoes and graduation this, graduation that. So with that being said next week um, cheer practice starts and I already know that Ava needs um, stuff for after school cheer so we picked up some cheer stuff to go in her basket and it's probably not a surprise because I think she's right behind me and Tupi's basket is going to be this stuff here but I think I need to get her something else so I just picked up two baskets that they can reuse and put stuff in in their rooms so then I added the little grass there so sidewalk chalk is really popular in my house they both still use it so i bought both of them one because they will fight over it and i saw this little cosmetic organizer it was only a dot well of course i was up to dollar tree i thought it was cute for ava like for her uh lip balms she uses the same one as me like the nivea and all of the other ones that i get so she can use that in her room uh, Ava loves to read and she loves to do word puzzles so I grabbed her one of those uh, headbands because of course she's going to need those for practice and a brush because I don't know what happened to hers and so she's always in our bathroom using ours so I bought her one just to keep in her backpack and just went over to Walmart and she's going to need this right here this is a sports bra so then I picked up oh and it was what 588 and then I picked up just some different shorts for her to wear. And those were about three bucks each. And then just these little tanks for a dollar and sixty-eight cents. And then there's another pair of shorts under there. So I'm gonna have to buy all of this stuff anyway. So it's just makes sense for me to just buy it and put it in her Easter basket because she's gonna need all of this stuff next week. And um I'll probably put some hot fries. She just Ava's not a big candy eater. She likes hot fries. So I'll throw some hot fries in there. And so far, this is what we have for Tupi sidewalk chalk headbands because she actually did need those. Yesterday, she asked me for crayons. I think, she, I don't know what she did with her. She probably broke them. Broke them, I mean. So then I also grabbed her a uh, coloring book. She loves bubbles, so I saw that. So I thought, you know what, we'll grab that. I was going to get one of the big ones. But then I thought, let me wait because she'll want to use the whole entire thing the first day that she opens it. So if you get this small, we'll pace ourselves. And then I just thought that these different eggs were super cute. She needs eggs for school, so she has to have 12 eggs. So I got the jumbo size eggs for her to take to school. I need to fill these up with candy. And I saw these here, little bunny rabbits. And it was so funny because as soon as I left Dollar Tree, I went to Walmart and their eggs are 88 cents. And I was like, oh, I just wasted 12 cents extra per package of eggs. But I don't think these, like, fancy schmancy ones, I didn't see those at Walmart. But I really like those for two piece. So I'm going to put some probably airheads in there. She likes airheads. So I'll probably put those in there and put them in her basket. These, again, these two here are going to go with her to school. And yeah, we just don't do the traditional baskets in our house. My mom always gets the kids baskets anyway. So my mom goes overboard. She gets them huge baskets still. So I try to get things that they need and definitely reusable baskets. So this is 
what I'm putting together. I got to get this all put together. I'm not probably not going to make a Easter basket video this year. I just don't have the time to do it. We have a wedding this weekend and we have family in from California. So I won't have time to do it. I'm just going to have to rush and put this together. So I probably won't make a video. But if you need ideas and your kids are in sports or whatever and you are writing out a lot of checks and things, uh, do like me. Get them things that they need. Uh, because they definitely are going to have to have it anyways and it's better than buying a whole bunch of candy and things that they don't need when you're going to have to turn around and spend the same amount of money next week. Well, in my case, next week. So yeah, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I just decided to go to Dollar Tree and see what I could find. Just little single things. So yeah, it was handy. And I did look at the like other stuff there to see if they had like any Excedrin. I didn't see any at mine. I know we have those $1 off coupons, but I didn't see any. I didn't really see anything fancy there that was just like, oh, buy me. So, yep, this is my Dollar Tree Easter basket haul. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and thank you so much for watching. I love you to the minute back, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.